Hi guys, Yuri here again. Welcome to YB Plays Music. Copy mana copy. Welcome to all the Alippers back. I'm going to react to the newest one from Ali Bata, which is Far From Home. This is from Five Finger Death Punch. I had never heard of this band before and neither of the song. I have looked it up, the original song. I didn't know the song, uh, but now I do. And I have something to compare to, of course. Um, so without any further ado, guys, let's check it out. On this moment, it's just been released like two days ago from the time I'm recording this. So let's check it out. Here we go. Okay, we see the finger style here in the beginning, uh, of course, but I noticed he has a different guitar. It's a different guitar. Takamine, Takamine? I don't know the brand, but it's definitely a different guitar than, than usual. Uh, we see the part here when he where he controls the volume, treble, uh, loudness and such like, uh, where he probably also can insert uh, a cable to connect it to... A speaker let's say we also see it's connected actually we see the cable here on the back which is usually not the case with Alip we also see him wearing a headphone here it's unusual I haven't seen that before with him we also have this section in between um, so he actually uses this as a, a pickup bar um, that's pretty unusual for an acoustic guitar even for a semi-acoustic we don't usually have pickups so i don't know is he going to use some distortion or some other effects on the sound from his guitar uh is that why it's plugged in i'm really wondering guys uh that's very interesting to see right here but let's check out what he's going to do there's a little reverb on the sound melody from the voice Ooh, nice pull-offs It's pretty apparent that when he taps the upper string with his thumb, uh, it's, it's, the sound is very clear to hear. It's very noticeable here. And I don't know if that is why he chose to have this reverb, because it's, there's quite a lot, perhaps a little bit more than I would perhaps edit in uh, myself. Because if you were there in his room, the guitar wouldn't sound like that. Uh, this this reverb is because he connected this to uh, an, an audio source, an audio interface, or a speaker, or or an uh, or an audio recorder, which edited the reverb behind that. Some reverb can really add a cool effect and, and smooth some things out, but. In this case, it might be just a little bit too much, I think. Uh, it doesn't need to be that high, I think, for my preference, I would say. But let's just keep watching and see what he continues to do here. It sounds really smooth. Slight vibration there on the upper string. Swift. 
I see he uses a lot of hammer-on pull-off techniques with his pinky finger uh, and ring finger, let's say. And meanwhile, he does these bass lines with mostly middle finger and sometimes also ring and, and index finger. But uh, pinky finger is mostly doing uh, some hammer-on and pull-off techniques. The pinky is never doing the, the bass as far as I've noticed so far. Now, what I was about to say, what I mean by a little bit too much reverb is it might sound like some notes might be overlapping a little bit on the on the border of overlapping which can sometimes be a little bit distracting so when you lower the reverb a little bit i think it might sound a bit more clean i believe because it's not the way he plays it it's not that it doesn't sound clean but i think because the reverb is a little bit higher than i would prefer let's say i think that is why it might just sound a little bit cleaner if it was a little bit lower, um, the reverb. Let's keep on listening to the rest. Still so seamless though. Does he have a tre no? Well, I thought he had a tremolo bar there. I was like thinking that on an acoustic a tremolo bar. How did he do that? Let's see. How? Wait, what is he actually doing here? He's bending with his middle finger there, but I think he's also like pushing and pulling the 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 arm of the guitar to him and away from him which gives some effect. Let's listen to that again. I think so. I think he's pushing with his elbow like this and pulling with his arm and doing this continuously, which gives this vibrating sound. It wasn't too clear. I first thought like, wait, what? A, a tremolo bar on an acoustic? guitar but then i thought like oh no it's not it's not bad at all <laughs> but it just sounded like that because a tremolo bar uh makes so that if you hit it there is some vibration there and the way he holds his right hand here it first looked that way but it isn't okay <laughs> that was interesting now i gotta say guys when i heard the original song i was like okay um, I'm pretty curious what Alip will, will make of this because it's not the most impressive song musically that I've heard before and surely not the most impressive song that uh, Alip Bata has done so far. He has a lot more impressive songs that he covers or uh, not too complicated songs that he makes just incredibly good as well. And this is nice, but it's not my favorite from him, let's say that. Uh, it is interesting though, this hat, I've, I don't think I've seen it before, the IMG, I don't know what logo this is, but it has to be something musically because this is like a plug-in, like an, an input cable for, uh, for a guitar, uh, which is connected to the G. And I, it also kind of reminds me of music uh, partitures. Um, I don't know how to say it in English, actually. But it seems similar to a symbol that they use in there. I don't know the name of that in, in, in English, actually. But it reminds me of that. Like I said, guys, it's not the most impressive um, song that he's done before. This seems for him like a walk in the park. Whilst for me, that would be... <laughs> Uh, pretty impossible to do uh, exactly like, like he does. Uh, but we've seen him doing so many impressive things over all these videos that now and then we just have to have some songs that are less impressive than the one he's done already. So that's fine. Uh, it is a unique setup that we see here though. Like the guitar is different, the sound is different. It's something new. I don't know why specifically for this song he uses that. Or is this something that he's going to um, use in, in, in all of his future videos? Or in just a select few of his videos? If you know why this change is here, then let me know in the comment section below, guys. Uh, that he just upgraded his gear? And is he searching still for the right sound setup? Uh, let's say that's possible. Uh, I remember when I started making some uh, music videos... 
um, in the past, which are, I mean, it's it's so low scale exposure. It doesn't really mean anything for most people. But like when I started making these music videos and recording the music from a couple of, from like four, five, six years ago, <laughs> when I listen to that now, I think like, okay, there's too much... Uh, reverb it's the, the the voice is too much in the background the sound is not too clear let's say it's not like i really want it to be so i so i see there is some evolution throughout the years even though i have not that many music videos so i assume if he does this in future videos i think he might improve on that and it's not the way he plays is just stays stays incredible but i think he might improve on the on the quality of the of the editing after on the on the sound that is Okay, so it's interesting to see him in this new setup. And I'm very curious to see more future videos of him. And of course, you guys have made so many other suggestions for older songs, which I'll do, of course, don't worry. I will get to those as well. But from time to time, it's nice to see a new video that he just brought out. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed my reaction. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the video. Also, don't forget to check out my other reactions to Ali Bata, still my most watched videos on the channel. Also, don't forget, I have music videos and tutorials for you guys to check out. So, thank you very much. Terima kasih, and see you guys next time. Bye! Welcome to YB Plays Music. Well, to this is from five. This is from five. Uh, it's not. I have. I haven't seen it that. Uh, the, the, because that's not the sound. If you were there in uh, 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 with his pinky ring and 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 um, then I would uh, vibrating. It's not really. A and I think that's why this, this, there is some. I first thought. I first and 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 he has a lot more and and. But it's 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 to suit from now to from now it's it's a bit, a bit but it it's all. Uh,